BIM 360 has always had the ability to navigate a 3D model. But with some enhancements, we've actually made that navigation a lot easier. Utilizing the levels within a model itself, we can filter out the model based upon the constraints that were created inside of Revit. In selecting level 2, I'm isolating out everything else except for what's on level 2. The ability to take a selection of a ceiling to hide it and navigate to a specific location in the model allows us to more accurately place us where we would like to be and utilizing the first person mode now we can navigate in that model as we would be walking down the hallway. The ability to view, review, or create issues allows us to share information with different project stakeholders very easily. The ability to create markups help illustrate the information we're trying to portray in a 3D manner. But we're not stuck to a single level. We have the ability to bounce from level to level to create A to B navigation very easily. By selecting on objects, we can either hide them or selecting on white space, unhide them. It gives us the ability to turn on and off objects that we need or do not need during this process.